لا يؤاخذكم الله باللغو في أيمانكم ولكن يؤاخذكم بما كسبت قلوبكم والله غفور حليم Allah will not take you to task for the oaths you utter in vain, but will certainly take you to task for the oaths you utter in earnest. Allah is all forgiving, all forbearing. For those who vow abstinence from their wives, there is a respite of four months. Then, if they go back on their vow, they will find that Allah is all-forgiving, all-compassionate. And if they resolve on divorce, surely Allah is all-hearing, all-knowing. والمطلقات يتربصن بأنفسهن ثلاثة قروء ولا يحل لهن أن يكتمن ما خلق الله في أرحامهن في أرحامهن إن كن يؤمن بالله واليوم الآخر وبعولتهن أحق بردهن في ذلك إن أرادوا إصلاحا ولهن مثل الذي عليهن بالمعروف وللرجال عليهن درجة والله عزيز حكيم Divorced women shall keep themselves in waiting for three menstrual courses, and it is unlawful for them, if they believe in Allah and the last day, to hide whatever Allah might have created in their wombs. Should their husbands desire reconciliation during this time, they are entitled to take them back into wedlock. Women have the same rights against their men as men have against them, but men have a degree above them. Allah is all-powerful, all-wise. الطلاق مرتان فإن ساك بمعروف أو تسريح بإحسان ولا يحل لكم أن تأخذوا مما آتيتم شيئا إلا أن يخافا إلا أن يخافا أن لا يقيما حدود الله فَإِنْ خِفْتُمْ أَلَّا يُقِيمَا حُدُودَ اللَّهِ فَلَا جُنَاحَ عَلَيْهِمَا فَلَا جُنَاحَ عَلَيْهِمَا فِي مَفْتَدَتْ بِهِ تِلْكَ حُدُودُ اللَّهِ فَلَا تَعْتَدُوهَا وَمَنْ يَتَعَدَّ حُدُودَ اللَّهِ فَأُولَئِكَ فَأُولَئِكَ هُمُ الظَّالِمُونَ Divorce can be pronounced twice, then either honorable retention or kindly release should follow. While dissolving the marriage tie, it is unlawful for you to take back anything of what you have given to your wives, unless both fear that they may not be able to keep within the bounds set by Allah. Then, if they fear that they might not be able to keep within the bounds set by Allah, There is no blame upon them for what the wife might give away of her property to become released from the marriage tie. These are the bounds set by Allah. Do not transgress them. Those of you who transgress the bounds set by Allah are indeed the wrongdoers. <laughs> حتى تنكح زوجا غيره فإن طلقها فلا جناح عليهما أن يتراجعا أن يتراجعا إن ظنا أن يقيما حدود الله وتلك حدود الله يبينها لقوم يعلمون Then If he divorces her for the third time after having pronounced the divorce twice, 
she shall not be lawful to him unless she first takes another man for a husband and he divorces her. There is no blame upon them if both of them return to one another thereafter, provided they think that they will be able to keep within the bounds set by Allah. These are the bounds of Allah which He makes clear to a people who have knowledge of the consequences of violating those bounds.